ngelakuin. guys welcome back to hoot nanny homestead today i am up potting some broccoli that we had started last sunday and it has come on to the point that it is ready to be separated i put about 10 seeds in each cell Now I need to go through and pull off what I need, break them up. Um, I figure at this point they're all strong. They all deserve a chance if they've come this far. So I'm just gonna go through and make way for them. And I start by getting some, some new cells. about three quarters of the way full. Come over here and set them on the table to where it's going to be needed. Here's the broccoli itself. Come on pretty good. So we're going to See what we can save out of them. There's 12. I'm gonna do up 24. I believe I have that over there. Plan it up. That needs to be separated. Now broccoli doesn't like its roots to be messed with, but I do believe every plant has a uh, forgiving time that you can jostle the root and it it doesn't affect it too much, um, if at all, any. But that's a short window, and you kind of have to move quick. Um, from this point forward, it will be only the strong survive, because uh, I'll have what I want pulled off. Um, so all the extras will just be trimmed back make way for the larger. This gives us 18. Make sure I give myself space to work. And just like that, we've got what we need. The rest of this dirt will go into a, a raised bed that we've been working on in the back. It's taken quite a bit of dirt to fill it up. And all that dirt wasn't gotten in one day, so I'm just kind of working on it leisurely. I'll probably replant lettuce in that bed, or not lettuce, uh, spinach. Our spinach uh, seed didn't take, it wasn't ours, it was uh, what we had purchased. It didn't take, so we are going to break into our seed, which should have done it all along, and start some baby spinach. We can still chop it and freeze it. 
make a little one pound greaser packs for it. Alright, so we've got 24 of these cells here made up and I'm just going to go through and start separating. Um, I'm going to go with the larger ones here first. Two, three, four, five. There's six coming up in there. Um, actually, seven. But I'm going to only take the stronger ones. here about three quarters of the way full go through and use my finger work out a little little bowl out of the center of it and I push it down in there just to make sure it's all snug I like to get all the dirt off of the innates clover <laughs> neat so so we got seven out of that one
Well, I clearly didn't put enough soil. that one. I guess it's 15. Three pack. Probably should have done this. Three. I got three out of it. Yay. Three out of twelve ain't bad.
have way more than three more in this. I can do fake. I feel like it snapped, so it may not make it. Let's see. I generally feel when they snap, you pull them out. When that happens, that's not good. But hopefully, they're small enough that it doesn't really be too much of an issue. Get out of that one. Nice. That's if they all make it. My fingers crossed. Populated ones, uh, where they were having 100% germination coming up out of them. Uh, this one is getting there. We've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine in that one, which means there's probably ten. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight coming up out of that one. We've got five in this one. So, and these are just heavier ones that need to be broke up. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven. There's a seven in that one. They're just coming coming up in a cluster right there. And I believe they're small enough to handle them now so that it doesn't affect them. Uh, the main thing is to get them watered. So let's go ahead and get that taken care of. going to water from bottom up. Let's go ahead. This thing is going to get pretty heavy, so let me go ahead and get it where it's going to be setting. Everybody's stinking. 
flat. It's taking on water. Still drinking the bottom up. Still need one more. Let me do one more because I can always pour it off. So, we've got another tray to where we can do 28 more. The broccoli's doing great. Then we'll mosey on over here and show you. And this is what we just separated. What tells me if they take is if they'll stand straight up. Now some are standing straight up already, but uh, they may limp over here in a little bit. Uh, they all should rebound today and let me know if they make it or not. Cross your fingers.